Actually, I came from a village to be honest. But uh, we do not have uh, TVs, uh, not really. But once in a year, I can say like not once in a month or once in a while, but once in a year or twice in a year, we watch movies. From they bring like um, uh, TV and a cassette, and uh, we use a generator to watch the movie. So the whole day will come, sit and watch the movie. And when I came here. I was on my bed watching everything, every kind of movie. I remember that I w I finished five seasons in two days. It was kind of hard to live the, the life that I want in where I came from. But when I came here, I, I was always open-minded. So when I came here, I just started living my life on my own way. Like, I don't have to be... To be to hide myself or to be someone else, I was open. I really feel welcomed in Belgium, not by the government, I can say, but the people, yeah, I really felt welcome. And it kind in Cine Maximilian, it kind of have this feeling of homey, you know, like even though some people they are far from their family, but still, when you come to Cine Maximilian, you feel like you're so close to your family. For me, for as I experience, it's more like a feeling, feeling for me. I just, I don't just call it cinema, cinema but it's like a kind of house to me. It's a kind of message to the people that don't have like residency, like telling them you have been living your life, like half of your life, like the age where you are, whatever in your age you are, and uh, you should not do any stupid thing. A piece of paper cannot control you. For me, for example, I stay here three years and I don't have residency. But look at me now today, I'm doing my movie, I'm so glad that it went to Lumiere, like in film fest again. Even though I was so proud that they liked the movie and they selected, we just only seen the rough cuts. They didn't see the full movie, they just saw the rough cuts. And I'm really proud of it, so if you want to do something, make an example, don't, don't be stupid. I'm super excited and proud. At the same time, I'm like freaking out to the limit because <laughs> um, it's actually kind of it's exciting and also it's stressful because after the movie, there's gonna be Q &A, like question and answers like Q and A, and uh, I'm gonna stand in front of so many people on the stage. I actually stand on this stage many times with Cinema Media. like I do a lot of presentations but this time I'm just gonna be alone and be asked so many questions so I'm like...